So th this is from um, Stuart in Doncaster. And Stuart says, is it wrong for men to wolf whistle at women? Ooh. Is it wrong well, for men to wolf whistle at women? What I have noticed over the last 30 years is that builders have become a lot more polite. Oh, no. <laughs> um, they don't wolf whistle oh, as much as they used to, um, which I think, um, it, I think it's all about intention, isn't it? And, and, and also how it's going to be received. Um, I would actually really love it if someone wolf whistled at me. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to be honest, there's no point. I'm a bad, bad, bad feminist. Have you ever wolf whistled at anybody? Jim, come on. Ha no. have, have you wolf whistled at anyone no, today? No, not really. Not lately. Oh, fucking hell. Have you seen the state of some of the women walking around this country? <laughs> <laughs> oh, seriously. Seriously. Why, why do women spend all their time, the young women all want to look alike, shave their eyebrows off and draw them ones on like ventriloquist dolls, fake tan, lips like a 12-seater rib, big ass <laughs> sticking out, false tits, false eyelashes, they all look the same like the fucking letter S walking along. You couldn't wolf whistle at that. If you was a wolf, you'd fucking bite its head off. You no. wouldn't whistle at it. <laughs> no, 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 I won't. And, 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 and it, takes, it takes it further. It takes it, you, you, can't, you can't wolf whistle at anyone. You can't pinch their ass in a bar in the House of Commons. What the fuck is, what is it with you women that you don't want to be sexual objects? Because I've had a look at the audience and a lot of you fucking ain't. <laughs> oh, seriously, what is this Me Too movement for fuck's sake? Can't, you can't chat a woman up anymore. What you've got to do is, can you sign this affidavit? Why is that? Because I want to ask you if you'd like a drink and come round the back of the bike sheds for the good news. <laughs> God forbid, God forbid you try and kiss a woman. What's going on? What? So we just don't no, speak Jim. to women no, anymore. No, no, is that what, is that that. What, is that if what you, you try need? and kiss a woman when you haven't been invited to kiss a woman. Oh, that's... fuck off. You'd never be invited. No one would invite me. You've got to talk them into it. That's it's romance. So rude. Have you not seen the films? <laughs> My darling, you are so beautiful. Oh, I love. Oh. And they come together like that, don't they? Oh. It's wonderful. It's called romance. It's, it's men and women. Fiction. Or men and men. That's what it's called fiction. It's called what? It, it's called it's fiction. It's called fiction, Jim. It's a made-up yeah, story. Do, you do I must that. live in the real world, though, because I believe there's men and women, and if there's how 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 do they want to be babies if you can't chat a woman up? You can't you've got, chat you've a woman up. You've got to take up, your Jim. chance, haven't you? <laughs> you've got to take your chance. You've got, excuse me, can about, I? It's not about good. chatting women up, Jim. It's Jim, about, if I took my chance and chatted up a random stranger, I'd get a black eye. <laughs> Need to be a fucking big stranger. <laughs> 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 they tend to be. So I, I think, yeah, look, I was, I'm born straight male. Um, I find women attractive. I've, you know, I have a desire to have sex with women. <laughs> now, life teaches you <laughs> that you can't do that with every woman. So you learn skills. And one of the skills you need to learn is respect. Okay. And I want women what? to be able to walk down the street and say, because me going to Sam, you look great, is different to someone going to her, oh, you look great. It's all about where that line is. And I think too often, decent blokes end up getting offended on behalf of the creepy blokes. Hang it's on, your problem is you can't pull birds, right? It's as fucking simple as that. It's as fucking simple as that. Could you go up to a girl and say, excuse me, can I buy you a drink and maybe, you know, we might go out and take your dinner. And they go, fuck off, where me? Here we go. Here's Just flash the credit card. Here's a story for you. That when I was on Britain's Got Talent, I was stood next to Colm Scott and one of the judges walked past and she looked absolutely beautiful, right? And I said, uh, I said, you look absolutely stunning tonight, Alicia. Oh, Sexist. fuck, I'm giving her my word. Right? Now, that was me being a gentleman, giving yeah. her a compliment, right? She thought that I was being sexist and she just ignored me and gave me like a mucky look. So, who this is, is this woman who? Alicia Dixon. But wait, wait, wait. Oh, Amy. yeah, well, she's, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's like a self-licking ice cream, isn't she? Yeah, did I or did I not compliment you on your shoes tonight, big man? Yes, of course. I did. Because your shoes look good. I told you, your jacket looks good. Yeah. yeah. By the same token, I say, Sam, you look good. I'm not going, well, Sam, you look like bang fucking tidy and nothing to the lads. They're, if you're going to be complimentary, there's nothing wrong with being complimentary. But I don't want either of you to feel creeped out by my erection. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.